Dean, a difficult result today. Um, what went wrong? <laughs> we can't concede the goals we conceded and defend the way we did. Um, and expect to win football matches. They conceded after 57 seconds, I think we conceded, and then we conceded right on half time. Um, just disastrous times to be conceding. And uh, yeah, look, listen, we did, I thought our back three were shocking today. I thought the defenders, the standards they set themselves were, were really poor. And uh, we kept going in the end. We had good character, good fight. We kept going, but we gave ourselves a mountain too big to climb. Um, obviously, at the end, we've, we did get those two goals. Is there any other sort of positives we can take from today? Obviously, Ultron and they're in the playoffs. They've had a good season so far. Is there anything we, positives we can take from this result today? Yeah, Ultron, I would say it. You know, they've invested heavily in their squad. Um, they've gone full time. They've got good players, good manager. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't understand why we think we should just be coming here and winning. Like. That's, I think it's a disrespect to Altrincham. Um, tough game. Um, I think it was Tord versus sixth, and they've come out on top. So full credit to the opposition. Well, obviously, one of the big talking points going into this was in your lineup. We signed uh, Keeley during the week in on loan from Tottenham. Uh, what was the thought process of picking him today? Yeah, look, listen, he's a different type of goalkeeper. We thought we'd have a lot of possession, which we did do. Um, it don't help, and his defenders don't give him a dig out in the first few minutes. In basically the first few, few seconds of the game, and we don't switch on from a, from a, uh, a set piece. The lads are trying to say that the referee said um, it'll be on the whistle, and then he's took her without the whistle. This is what the players are telling me. I don't know how true that is. Um, another notice, noticeable absence was Dale Gorman. Has he picked up a knock at all this last yeah, week? He's out, he's out now. He's out, he's out long term. He's got knee injury. We scanned him today. He's out. Uh, Danny Collins is out. Big players for us. We've got injuries now, this is what happens this time of the year. And the players that come in have to step up to the plate, and I thought some of them today let themselves down. Uh, we've got a game on Tuesday, Dagenham now is a quick turnaround. Is that an opportunity now to, to turn things around again? I think we've got to get back down the motorway, it's been a long day. We left the hive this morning at 8 o'clock, um, which is not ideal preparation, I have to be honest. And um, We've had a flu bug in our camp, personally I haven't been in work all week. So I've got to really take responsibility for the week. I, mean, I ain't been able to attend. Uh, it's been left with the staff, and I'm the person that runs the ship. So um, I'm really frustrated and disappointed with everything that's happened today. I have to be honest with you. Um, I actually thought Josh did really well. I'll be honest with you. I thought he sweeped really well. His distribution was excellent. He made some good saves when he had to. Um, and then I thought, realistically, our players were just well below par. Now, they can blame it on that, whatever they want to blame it on. Um, I'm not really into all these excuses, so I've got to be honest with you, but it has been a long day, it is what it is. And uh, we just got to dust ourselves down, pull together, move on to the next game. But we, what we have to realise is this division's relentless. Relentless division. It's, you don't just turn up and win. We've got to earn the right to win, and I thought we didn't do that well enough today. Um, but I thought some of our players' performances was well below par. And just finally, just a, a mention to the 108 Barnet fans that have come in today. We've got quite a few long away days this month. What's your message to them tonight? Yeah, look, listen, we just move on to the next game. Thanks for the support. Obviously, today is not our day. Like I said to you all the time, it's so easy to be happy and jolly when you're winning in, this, in, in these games. This is when you see the real character of real teams. So we've just got to dust ourselves down and move on and hopefully we can give them something to sing about on Tuesday night. Dean, thank you for your time. Cheers,